Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Clem. You made the right choice. I let you down. <coughs> I let everyone down. Just, just hang on, Kenny. Please. No, no, you're better off without me. We almost made it. We were close, weren't we? <coughs> I thought I wanted this. Asked for it so many times. Now that it's happening, I'm scared. <coughs> I'm afraid, Clem. It's okay, Kenny. You're... You're going to see Kutch and Duck. You're going to see them again. Oh, you're always good for a smile. Alive. I understand if you're upset. AJ was never in any danger. I was just going to try to talk you into coming with me. I just thought if you saw Kenny like that, you'd know we'd have to leave him. Look, Clem, I'm sorry. I didn't think Kenny would go that far. But it's over now. We're all safe. We're going to be okay. I don't understand. Kenny was dangerous. And I needed you to see that, one way or another. What are you saying? I had to do it, Clem. You saw how he reacted. I had to show you what he was capable of. It was a stupid... I should never have lied to you. But I thought it was the only way you'd see. Oh my god! Kenny, you have to forgive me. Please. We can just leave all this behind us. Please. I did it for you, Clem. For us. We're free now. I forgive you, Jane. Thank you. Thank you, Clem. You were right about Kenny. All along, you knew what he was gonna do. It's over now, Clem. Let's just put all this behind us. I can't see much from here. Come on. I don't... I don't know how you were able to watch that. I've seen worse. Here's the food. 
Clem, there's formula. Bonnie was right. The greenhouse is in good shape. You know, maybe we should stay here a while. See how it goes. Just, just stay behind me. Clem. Come on. They don't look armed. Is this your place? We're just passing through. Yeah? How fast do you think? We haven't decided yet. We need help. My boy, he... He ain't doing so good. What's wrong with him? Look, uh, don't worry. He ain't, uh, he ain't bit. Just hungry. We've been walking for weeks. Ran out of food a couple days back. That's your kid? Where you girls been? Why do you care? Whoa, I, I didn't mean nothing by it. Everywhere. All over. You, uh, been up north? Yeah. Yeah, us too. Keep your eye on him. This place needs a lot of work. Yeah? Yeah, we could help you. There's not that much food left. Please. We won't make it another night out here. Look, I know you don't know us, and I know a lot of people out here say a lot of things. But I'm asking you, as a father, please, don't turn us away. I don't know, Clem. They could be anybody. Do we really want to go through this again? Please. We'll die out here. Just give us a chance. Give us a chance to prove ourselves. You won't regret it. I promise you. You have to let us in. Come in. <sighs> Thank you. Around the side. You sure about this? This place is a mess, and I don't know how long that food will last. It'll take a lot of work. Maybe we can start something here, Jane. It's not much, but we'll make it better. Just keep your eyes on him. We'll be fine. My name's Patricia. Jane. Thank you, Jane. Don't mention it. Thank you so much. Of course. Cool hat. Yeah, thanks. Can't see much from here. Come on. I don't know how you were able to watch that. I'm glad I did. Here's the food. Clem, there's formula. Bonnie was right. The greenhouse is in good shape. You know, maybe we should stay here a while. See how it goes. Just, just 
Stay behind me. Clem. Come on. They don't look armed. This your place? It's big. Quiet. Go away. Uh, all right, wait a second. Just hear me out. We need help. My boy, he... He ain't doing so good. What's wrong with him? Look, uh, don't worry. He ain't, uh, he ain't bit. Just hungry. We've been walking for weeks. Ran out of food a couple days back. That's your kid? Where you girls been? Why do you care? Whoa, I, I didn't mean nothing by it. Step away from the fence, please. Keep your eye on him. This place needs a lot of work. Yeah? Yeah, we could help you. There's not that much food left. Please. We won't make it another night out here. Look, I know you don't know us, and I know a lot of people out here say a lot of things. But I'm asking you, as a father, please, don't turn us away. I don't know, Clem. They could be anybody. Do we really want to go through this again? Please, we'll die out here. Just give us a chance. Give us a chance to prove ourselves. You won't regret it. I promise you. You have to let us in. Leave. What? You heard me. Now. Please, don't do this. Are you sure you want to do this, little girl? I mean, what if... what if we're dangerous? What if I am? Come on, honey. Let's go. Thanks for doing that. After looking at that kid, I wasn't sure if I could. But we had to. We have to look out for ourselves now. Sometimes, you have to hurt someone else to protect the people you care about. A friend told me that once. They might come back. Then we'll be ready. Alive. I understand if you're upset. AJ was never in any danger. I was just going to try to talk you into coming with me. I just thought if you saw Kenny like that, you'd know we'd have to leave him. Look, Clem, I'm sorry. I didn't think Kenny would go that far. Upset? You're fucking crazy. How could you do this? I had to do it, Clem. You saw how he reacted. I had to show you what he was capable of. So you put AJ in danger and got my friend killed just to prove a point? It was a stupid plan. I should never have lied to you. But I thought it was the only way you'd see. Oh my god. Kenny, you have to forgive me. Please. We can just leave all this behind us. Please. I did it for you, Clem. For us, we're free now. I'm not going anywhere with you. Clem, please. 
I did this for you. I can't do this alone, okay? Is that what you want to hear? Clem? I'm right behind you! Let me see him. I thought... I thought we lost you, buddy. I won't let you out of my sights again. Then you... You didn't have to kill her. You didn't have to kill Jane. It was me or her, Clem. She was trying to kill me, too. If she hadn't lied about Alvin here, it wouldn't have went that far. I just... Why would she? She was nuts, Clem. A disturbed person that had her own agenda and was looking out for herself. Shh, shh, shh. It's all right, buddy. 
Hey, listen, I didn't want that to happen either. I thought she'd killed Alvy Clem, and at any point she could have stopped what was happening by saying he was fine. She wanted a fight. I never, ever hurt you. You understand? I was protecting you. You believe me, right? Just imagining what she did to Alvy. Everything just went black. By the time I got my head straight, it was too late. You were right about her. She was unstable. Always just looking out for herself. Yeah. I wanted to be wrong. I did. But it was clear from the start. Come on. Let's put some miles between us and this place. It's just a little further. We're almost there. I sure hope that's a cook fire. Oh, we could use a hot meal right about now. Might be all I need. Come on. I'll race you to the top. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Come on, Alvy. We got this. <laughs> You cheated! Holy shit! We did it, Clem! That's... that's gotta be it! I... It's about time. You were telling me. What are we waiting for? Come on! This one's gonna be the one. Look at those walls! Finally feel safe, Clem. Be able to sleep at night. That's far enough. Just stay still, Clem. Do as she says. Put your hands up, Clem. Drop your weapons. Approach the gate. Just a couple of people at the front gate. They don't look like trouble. Sounds good. Hi, I'm Edith. Name's Kenny, and this year's Clementine. Hello. Oh, what a handsome boy. Look at him. What's his name? Alvin, Jr. Oh, he's gonna be a little heartbreaker when he grows up. Is there someone named Krista in there? I don't think so, dear. So, this is Wellington, right? A lot of people call it that. Okay, so what do we do to get in? Well, I'm afraid this is the part where I give you the bad news. The hell's this? That's some supplies. Food, water, what? some medicine, a first aid kit. Why are hit. you giving us this? Unfortunately, our community isn't accepting new members. We're over capacity as it is, and there's just not enough to go around if we keep bringing people in. Things might change in you a few months. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I'm sorry. I really am. But there's only two of us. I know, dear. But I don't make the rules. Do you know what we've been through? You have any idea what it took for us to get here? And now, now you're just gonna turn us away. Look, I don't mean to be harsh, but a whole lot of other people went through a whole lot of stuff to get here too, and they all got here before you. 
And, and don't think you're the first people we've had to turn away. You're not. But that doesn't mean I'm not real, real sorry to have to do this. If, if it was up to me, I... Just take the kids. What? Please, just take the kids. It's too dangerous out here for them. Kenny, I... It's just a little girl and a baby boy. You can make room for that. You can take back the supplies you gave us if that helps. Please, just... I need them to be safe. And it's safe in there. I know that. Just ask someone, please. They won't make it out here. Please. Well, I'll ask. Just give me a second. You don't need to look at me like that. We're not staying here without you. Yes, you are. No, we're not. Yes, you are. It's safe here. You two will be safe. That's what's important now. We can take the children, but... Just the children. I made the case that... Thank you. Thank you. Listen, okay? Listen. This is your chance. For you and this boy. I don't trust myself to keep you two safe. Not anymore. Please, I'm begging you. Please, stay here. Stay here, where it's safe. Where you two will have a chance. No, no, no! Why are you doing this? Because it's the only way for both of you. Think about Alvy here. Please, Clem, just do as I'm asking. This one last time. You'll meet people. You'll make friends. People better than me. Good people. They, they don't have to look at you and feel ashamed at what they put you through. Please, Clem, please. Where you won't have to sleep with a gun next to you every night. You can be a kid for a while. No! We're leaving! All of us! Together! Clem, please. It's safe here. Do you need to Stop. think about the- Stop! Okay? We're not staying, so just stop. That's that. Sounds like. Sounds like she means business. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, it does. Come on. We're leaving. I'm only supposed to give out one per group, but look, if you're in the area, check back in a few months. We might be accepting people then. Thank you for the help, and uh, sorry for the language. Well, it's a shitty situation. We're all doing the best we can. You all stay safe out there. Stubborn as a damn mule. Yeah? Wonder where I got that from. You want me to hold him? Nah, he's still light. We're fine. Come on, I'll race you to the top. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Come on, Alvy, we got this. <laughs> you cheated. 
Holy shit. We did it, Clem. That's... that's gotta be it. I... <laughs> Looks like a big wall. What? Out here? In the middle of nowhere? No. That's gotta be it. What are we waiting for? Come on! This one's gonna be the one. Look at those walls. We'll finally feel safe, Clem. Be able to sleep at night. That's far enough. Just stay still, Clem. Do as she says. Put your hands up, Clem. Drop your weapons. Approach the gate. Just a couple of people at the front gate. They don't look like trouble. Sounds good. Hi, I'm Edith. Name's Kenny, and this year's Clementine. Hello. Oh, what a handsome boy. Look at him. What's his name? Alvin, Junior. Oh, he's gonna be a little heartbreaker when he grows up. Why'd you make us leave our stuff over there? Can't we just bring it in? What? Well, I'm afraid this is the part where I give you the bad news. The hell's this? That's some supplies. Food, water, what? some medicine, a first aid kit. Why are kit. you giving us this? Unfortunately, our community isn't accepting new members. We're over capacity as it is, and there's just not enough to go around if we keep bringing people in. Things might change you in a few months. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I'm sorry. I really am. So we're supposed to just take this and go? But, but, we have a baby! This, this is hard for me too. I don't want to turn anyone away, especially children. But... Just take the kids. What? Please. Just take the kids. It's too dangerous out here for them. Kenny, it's I... It's just a little girl and a baby boy. You can make room for that. You can take back the supplies you gave us if that helps. Please, just... I need them to be safe. And it's safe in there. I know that. Just ask someone, please. They won't make it out here. Please. Oh. Um. I'll ask. Just give me a second. You don't need to look at me like that. You're just gonna leave us? If they'll only take you two, then that's how it's gotta be. We don't even know these people! It doesn't matter. It's safe here. You two will be safe. That's what's important now. We can take the children, but just the children. I made the case that- Thank you. Thank you. Listen, okay? Listen. This is your chance for you and this boy. I don't trust myself to keep you two safe. Not anymore. Please, I'm begging you. Please, stay here. Stay here where it's safe. Where you two will have a chance. No, no, no! Why are you doing this? Because it's the only way for both of you. But think about Alvy here. Please, Clem, just do as I'm asking. This one last time. You'll meet people. You'll make friends. People better than me. Good people. They, they don't have to look at you and feel ashamed at what they put you through. Okay. Okay, we'll stay. Good. We'll stay. Good. This is the right decision. Okay. Right. When he's grown, you tell him about his mommy and his daddy and all the people who tried to keep him safe. You tell him, okay? He deserves to know. I, I got, uh... Oh, here. 
Here, take this. When he, when he's old enough, you make him wear it. It'll, it'll keep the sun out of his eyes. That's important. All right. Good. Keep an eye out for him. Please. Now, you take care of Alvin here. You, you live a good life, okay? Don't waste this, okay? Now, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. Before one of us... Before one of us changes their mind. Now, I'm gonna walk away. Not look back. Not because I don't want to. I'm real glad to have met you, Clementine. Let me see him. I thought... I thought we lost you, buddy. I... I can't believe he's alive. It's a miracle. I thought he was gone for good. I thought she'd taken him from us. I just... Why would she... She was nuts, Clem. A disturbed person that had her own agenda and was looking out for herself. Hey, listen, I didn't want that to happen either. I thought she'd killed Alvy Clem, and at any point she could have stopped what was happening by saying he was fine. She wanted a fight. I never, ever hurt you. You understand? I was protecting you. You believe me, right? Just imagining what she did to Alvy. Everything just went black. By the time I got my head straight, it was too late. We were already at each other's throats. You're... dangerous, Kenny. You're... You're right, Glam. But I'm trying to change. I'm working on it. Something... broke inside me. A long time ago. And I've just been trying to hold it together, but... I'm leaving. Clem, please. I don't want to go. I have to. I'll take AJ with you. He deserves a chance. I don't trust myself with him anymore. He'll... He'll have a better shot with you. Go on. Take him. Okay. Look at me, Clem. You made it this long. Think about all the other folks that didn't. That makes you special. Don't waste this, okay? You live a good life. You hear me? You protect him. You raise him right. You tell him about his mommy and his daddy and how they were good people. You tell him about everyone that worked so hard to keep him safe. Just like they did you. This is the right decision, Clem. You're right. Like you usually are. I ain't fit to care for y'all anymore. I'm real glad to have met you, Clementine.
Now, now go. Don't you fret, little guy. Big sister's gonna take care of you. Do it. Just... just do it. Okay. 